I'm David Story, and this is your Look News 411. The Hudson Falls man who allegedly set fire to his home after a standoff with police earlier this week. We've got an update on his condition. The Post Star reports Robert Fenton is listed in serious condition at a downstate hospital. Fenton suffered burns and cuts after the incident late Monday night on North Street. Police say he was being sought for a domestic dispute and for making suicidal comments when he refused to come out of his home. Charges are pending in the case. While a long vacant historic home will soon be reduced to rubble, the appellate court has upheld the Saratoga Springs Design Review Committee's decision to allow the demolition of the 150-year-old Winans Crippen House on 66 Franklin Street. The home has been vacant since 2006 and has fallen into a state of disrepair. The Saratoga Preservation Foundation says they are disappointed by the decision. Glens Falls has been selected to host the 2014 and 2015 Special Olympic State Games. The official announcement will be made on Monday morning at City Hall. Now, Special Olympics New York State Fall Games is one of three annual statewide competitions, and they hold more than 5,200 total competitions each year throughout the entire state. Nearly 800 athletes and coaches will be joining uh, together for the Fall Games in Glens Falls. Glens Falls has hosted the Fall State Games in 2011 and 2012. Well, after last night's fundraiser for the Saratoga Regional YMCA, the new Bowtie Cinema at the Wilton Mall is now open to everyone. The silver screens lit up last night for the fundraiser, while today the movie theater is now open to the general public. The eight-screen movie theater fills a spot vacated by Regal Cinemas earlier this year. It also includes a Bowtie Extreme large format auditorium. The theater is completely new. It's not the same theater from before. You know, take a look around, all brand new stadium seating, leather seats, um, custom leather seats built just for us, hot foods, uh, like I said, fresh popcorn with real butter, uh, all things that were never here before. This is Bowtie's second Saratoga County location. They opened in downtown Saratoga Springs last week. Well, rowers from across the country will be in Saratoga Springs this weekend for the annual Head of the Fish Regatta on Saratoga Lake. The local rowing event is expected to attract as many as 10,000 people to town. 2,000 boats are expected to take to the waters during the two-day event. Races begin at 8 o'clock Saturday and Sunday morning. Well, that's the latest headlines from the Look Newsroom. I'll see you back online Monday night. But for now, thanks for watching.